So we're going to model a mechanism for um, drawing a curve with the interesting name, the Witch of Anisi. Um, the part of the, the name uh, comes from a mistranslation um, of uh, the Italian Avere Sera, which meant um, a versed sine curve. And this kind of curve is uh, also called a versal curve. Um, and um, the Italian Aversiera, which means wife of the devil or witch. So this curve got the name uh, Witch of Venice, but it was, was um, uh, studied by a uh, female mathematician uh, uh, by the name of Venice. So here um, is a mechanism which can give us that. Um, we're going to uh, have a crank BC here, and we will put it at distance MR uh, away from the origin, and we'll give that crank a length R, and we'll rotate it. Um, with an angle theta. Uh, so there's obviously there's a slider uh, going, going backwards and forwards um, here. And we are now going to be able to um, uh, construct. Uh, that's not what I wanted to do. Uh, let's use an infinite line here. And this is going to be parallel to the y-axis, so we'll put that parallel constraint in there. Um, now we're going to draw the curve by attaching um, a line uh, perpendicular to that. Uh, Again, just parallel with the axis and another one perpendicular here. Again, um, the diagram gives you a way of doing that with an actual mechanism. Um, in fact, this line is being kept a specific distance away from the y axis. So I could, we could do that a couple of different ways. I could, uh, um, but I think what I'll do actually is just delete the. Uh, parallel constraint and replace that with a distance between two lines. So um, that gives me both the parallelism and a specific distance. Now my curve is going to be traced by E. We do that for theta. And there is the which of NSE curve. Um, we can watch um, that being traced. Let's drag that there. Uh, that point round. Um, or we can animate it, of course, over here. Um, Um, to find out what this equation is, we're going to the um, symbolic panel. Equation of that curve. Yeah, the equation of the witch of Annecy, uh, a most peculiarly named curve. 